Oh God, you are the most high. Hallowed be your name. Hallowed be your name. Oh God, you are the most high. Hallowed be your name. Hallowed be your name. Oh God, you are the most high. Hallowed be your name. Hallowed be your name. You are the most high. Hallowed be your name. In your words, you say, make with no worry. Yes, that everything is going to be all right. You are the father to the fatherless. Even the mother to the motherless. You made the blind man to see, yes. You made the crippled one to walk, yes. You are the great and morning stars. That's why I'm calling on you. Even if Nigeria government like me then turn the country up and down, no. We know you will be there for us because you are the great provider. Oh, you are the most high. Hello be the name. Oh my God, you are the most high. Hello be your name. You will say make we no worry, oh yes, that everything's gonna be fine. You brought us from a very long way. You made us see another day. You gave the poor man to eat. You gave the poor to. You made the poor to also live. You are the lily of the valley. That's why I call you Jehovah over the the God of all flesh, the unchangeable changer. The one that never sleep, you never slumber, you cease from afar, you have every destiny in your hands. Hello be your name, oh, Jehovah over the Dependable God, oh, you are reliable God, oh, we depend on you, oh, Baba God, you are the most high, hello be your name, hello be your name, Baba God, you are the most high, hello be your name, hello be your name. Oh God, you are the most high. Hello be your name. Hello be your name. God, you are the most high. Hello be your name. Actually, this song, I rephrase mine anyways, is originally written and sung by Chinedu Okolu, who goes by the stage name Flavor, and is Liberian adopted son, Sima Wifu. He titled it The Most High. So you can check it out on any social media platform of ease. You will see the complete song, all right? So guys, hmm, it is indeed well with Nigeria. I heard cement is 10,000 Naira, 11,000 Naira, 12 to 15,000 Naira presently in February 2024. Hmm. Which is over 10 pounds, my goodness, for 50 kg of cement. We are not even talking about food stuff. We are not talking about locally made food in Nigeria like the rice, gari, akbu, vegetables, pepper that farmers plant. Even we as humans, as residents and citizens plant in our backyard, everything don't skyrocket. Mm. Because of Tinubu fight government, all problems coming regime, APC, hmm, that we go overcome. What is as difficult as it was written in the Bible, the 10th plague. You guys know if you are a Bible scholar or Bible student, you know what happened when God punished the 
Egyptians that he even eliminated King Pharaoh's first son, which really touched him. And he eventually let the people of Israelites go, God's own people, who are after his heart. Until something terrible happens in this APC regime, <clears throat> these people will learn in the hard way, according to very dark black man. I am not praying for any evil predicaments to befall the country. I am not saying that something disastrous will happen to the rulers, the government, and those in government. But if care is not taken, my people, my brother man and sister woman, Nigeria as a country, hmm, they will learn in the hard way. People are crying because of high inflation. People are perishing, committing suicide. People are slumbing on the road. People are dying of starvation because there is no money to buy food. Even though there is money to buy the food, it's very expensive. And now, it is just for the rich. Yes, when I mean the rich, I'm talking of the extremely rich, the wealthy, because... Even in Nigeria, the rich also cry. You know, we have different categories when it comes to wealth. Nigerian government, you must see, they sit down, they look. Because you guys don't go to the market. You don't even watch what is happening on social media. You don't turn on the television to see the agony of pains. Now they hear them, but now they give deaf ears. As I said, we all know what happened in Egypt. And I understand, this one is not just because King Pharaoh, who was the ruler then, it affected the whole Egyptians. You understand? Mm -hmm. So, make una do something now before water go past Gario. Make una do something now before it is too late. Make una do something now before we will come the year I die no. Make una do something now before what God don't sit down for heaven, they see they go come release Zam and heal the land. Yes, because the psalmist says, If my people who are called by its name will humble themselves and pray, abstain from the wicked ways. God says he will heal the land. If God's people who are called by God's name will humble themselves and pray, stay away from the wicked ways. God says he will heal the land. Which land am I talking about? The land that is full of milk and honey, Nigeria, which is known as the giant of Africa. That's the land I am talking about that God says he will heal only if we will kneel down and pray and watch what God will do. And you will see that he will prove that he is God, God, God of all flesh. <laughs>